Good day. Welcome to Partaker's Friday Prayers on Friday the 16th of September 2011. Come, let's pray together. Father, as we commence, let our hearts and minds be right before you. We thank you for your Son, Jesus, and it's in his name we offer you these praises, prayers and petitions in the power of the Holy Spirit who lives inside those who are your children. Amen. We start with a time for you to offer your own praises to God. If for some reason words are failing you, simply say this, Lord God, I lift up thanks and praise to you alone. Let's praise God together. Hallelujah. Father, accept these praises as sweet-smelling perfume. Amen. Father God, we now lift this troubled world to you. From your wellspring of mercy, hear these petitions and cries. May justice and peace come to places where injustice, strife and conflict currently dominate. Where there is chaos, bring order. Where there is hatred, may love be sown. We pray that in areas of need following natural disasters, such as earthquakes and famines and uh, hurricanes, that aid will get through and infrastructure rebuilt. Lord, in your mercy, hear these prayers of your children. Amen. We now pray for church services around the world this weekend. Our Father God, we lift before you all those who are preaching, leading, serving and participating in church services around the world this weekend, both up front and in the congregation. We ask that the Holy Spirit would guide their minds and that the worship would be in spirit and in truth and that your word is faithfully preached. For those in countries where to meet other Christians is illegal or not condoned by the government, we ask that you continue to strengthen, guide, uplift and grow them. Let them know through your spirit, the spirit that lives within all believers, that we are praying for them. Amen. We come now to praying for the needs of these individuals. We pray specifically for Pam, Kerry, Denise, Joy, Ruth, Bronwyn, Bruce, Chris and Maggie. Please do add others known to you in this short time of silence in need of a healing touch. O oh, great God our provider, we ask for a healing touch and wisdom for the medical staff treating them. Now, Father, we lift before you all those facing challenging situations such as loneliness, confinement at home, geographical isolation, lack of employment, health issues and financial pressures. O oh, Father, please meet their needs in whatever challenging situation is being faced. And we put ourselves in your hands to help meet those needs where we can. And Father, we also pray that you will give strength to the weak, particularly for Sarah. We ask these things, our Father God, in the name of your Son, Jesus Christ, and in the power of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Father, be the strength for all those who are grieving and mourning the loss of loved ones. Father, we pray that those in despair will be helped, and where there is darkness, there will be light. Amen. And now as we close, may the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace in believing that you may abound in hope by the power of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you for joining us on Partaker's Friday Prayers.